Yo, today I'm really trying to accomplish goals. I have like things that I need to get done today and it's before I do other things. Today I actually have to go shoot photos for a baby shower and like uh, I don't know what the baby photos are called, but baby photos. And I need to get like three things done before I go do that, which is at three o'clock. But I think this is honestly just like a great time to actually look at the goals, look at the vision and be like, let's conquer it, let's do today's goals. And let's really handle these things. Because believe it or not, 2018 isn't like as cool as like I wanted it to be. And I know that sounds super dumb. I really just have higher expectations than my performance level right now. So even if the videos are A1 right now, you guys haven't seen anything yet. I'm gonna come out with a lot of fire coming soon. Matter of fact, starting today, if you guys are watching this, comment down great fam, so I know you're part of great fam. If you're not, please subscribe, turn on your notifications if you haven't turned on your notifications yet. Like the video and let's get started. Okay, so I was supposed to get a package today. I actually got two of them today. One of them said that the address was wrong and then the other one said that, well, it actually made it. So it was really annoying. I hate dealing with stuff like this. It'd be nice if people would actually handle their job correctly, I guess. But both of the addresses were the same. Also, I've been wearing this hoodie for the longest time, so. Okay, I'm actually filming this right now. This is like nice and I haven't worn it in a while. I'm gonna bring you guys into this mess with me. Okay, so I'm trying to contact USPS and I hate moderated. What are they called? Mod moderated systems or something like that? Welcome to the United States Postal Service. To hear our privacy policy, press one. Speak to a representative. This is higher than normal call volume and weather events. This may also be called a label number or article number. Sorry, I didn't get that. Say yes or press one. No or Oh my gosh, I'm gonna finish this and then... Yeah. So the wait time on a call was an hour and 11 minutes, so I said screw that, so I just went to the website and then scheduled a re-delivery. It doesn't make no sense. They said that the package was too big to fit in the mailbox. Duh. There's many reasons to be frustrated over this, but I'm not gonna let it get to me. I'm just gonna go and enjoy my day. Yo, it's definitely been a little bit since I've skated. But I haven't skated in probably, I don't even know how long, but today is the day and I just came to this random park. With that being said, let's skate some flat ground. It's actually really toasty outside, but it's not hot, so it's like perfect weather right now. The sun's just hot. Um, let's do it. All right, this is really hard. Okay, so skateboarding isn't as easy as it used to be. I'm like trying to land these simple tricks that I used to do all the time. And, and it's tough, if you take a break at something, you're definitely gonna lose it. If you don't use it, you lose it. That's definitely a principle that I think can apply to skateboarding. Second off, I was trying to find a park that no one was really at. Turns out there's like a birthday party. Looks like there's five birthday parties going on, but I mean, this is this is a really cool park, actually. But I'm actually exhausted. I only skated for a little bit. I'm gonna skate a little bit longer and go get ready for this baby shower. Uh, this is my first baby shower, so first time for everything, for sure. First baby shower, I'm not sure how everything goes. I don't think it's baby showers that get weird. I think it's like bridal showers. I think those things get weird, and I don't, I'm not even 100% for those things. The day must continue, even though the sun is murking me right now. But I am actually happy to see this weather because it has been freezing outside lately, and Phoenix definitely needs some weather like this that is a little warmer, but not too hot and not cold. So today's probably like in the 70s. Hey Siri, hey Siri, what's the temperature? It's 66 degrees oh, right now. See, it's perfect. 66 degrees is nice. This is beautiful. Since I only skated for a little bit. All right. Back from skateboarding, the park was actually really cool. I want to go to the park more often. I seen a bunch of people out there and they looked really, really happy. And I remember going to the park all the time and it's really fun. Like the park is fun. I like going with Candace and I like going with Kellen. I like going with Chandler. Okay. The list goes on and on. As long as we're outside, I love being outside. It's really awesome. And that's one thing that I haven't been doing lately, mostly because it's been freezing outside. Secondly is because uh, I, 
there's no other reason. <laughs> but the game is about to change, y'all. I'm telling you, the game is about to change. I actually have to change it myself, get ready for the baby shower, and dip set. So that's the plan. I'm actually about to make a list as well of what I need to accomplish after the baby shower because there is some stuff that I have to handle today so that it takes a workload off of tomorrow's list. Actually, I don't even want a list for tomorrow, so I want to finish everything for tomorrow today. So that's the plan. All right, so I'm heading to the baby shower right now. I'm meeting Candace there. This ought to be really interesting. First time ever shooting photos for a baby shower. First time ever being to a baby shower. First time going to a baby shower. Let's, let's see how I go. Wait, no, I've been to a baby shower before, haven't I? I think so. Maybe. I can't remember. I think I have actually. Never mind. Yeah, I've been to one before. First time shooting photos though. Yo, we are in here. All right, y'all. So I'm about to get a fade. Young Diddy is about to hook it up real fat. I'm actually just uh, gonna brush down everything, get it popping per use. Little calm action. Squad, what's up, y'all? Let's gang, get this. Gang. Let's get this money. Today I'm just getting a normal how I get the high top fade. It's gonna look super clean. I'm super excited, y'all. Uh, I do got a whole bunch of mess up here, so you guys can take a look. And I do just got a whole bunch of action going on up here. It's insane. Um, a whole bunch of growth. I was gonna grow it out and see if I can even handle it all the way to the wedding, but then I'm like, I was playing myself for even thinking that. So, let's do this. You ugly too. <laughs> okay, haters mad always. John 3-3. Three, three. John 3 to go. I can do all things through Christ who gives me the strength of. I can do all things through Christ. Um, you don't even know that verse. He got it in his bio too. Wow. Unto him who is able to do... <laughs> um, Ephesians 4 All three. things through Christ. Ephesians 4 Unto him who is able to do all things through Christ who strengthens him. Matthew 18-19. Um, Oh. Greater is he than he that is in John 3? <laughs> I'm done too. You're about to ask questions. Then, take questions. We share by giving information. To the woman, all aspects of their relationship are affected. All of <laughs> Guys, we could argue, debate, get mad, and then two days later, we're going to hang out. I mean, it could be the same day. We're gonna hang out. What you mean you're gonna hang out? Didn't y'all just have a, yeah, we did. But it's over now. All right. What are y'all like? <laughs> don't talk to me, don't call me. Don't even, when we sit in church, don't even look at it. All areas of your relationships are affected. Because you process your relationships through how you feel. Right. We don't process our relationships by how we feel. Even though the new term is bromance, I don't have no bromances. I don't like nobody like that but my wife. So we can have a fight and still hang out. Because I don't need from you what I should be getting from If you see him nodding his head and you think, oh, he's just listening, this is why you then come back and say, what do you think about it? And he's like, <laughs> why wish you just answer me? I don't know why you want to tell, I just got to walk around this house trying to read your mind. Well, and he's like, <laughs> you know what that means? I agree. I'm in agreement. Let's do it. Get it done. And you're thinking, he's just, what is he doing? He's just listening. Because that's what you do. Are you with me? Oh, these are good, aren't they? Mm -hmm. Now, now, now watch, now watch this last one. I call it the Garden of Eden Complex. <laughs> the Garden of Eden Complex is Women will see men as unbending. Well, you know, if I tell you you can't go out, you ain't going out. Mm -hmm. I don't care how many times you ask. I don't care how you ask. You're not going out. All of a sudden, mom can be worn down. And then husband sees her as too giving. You're giving kids everything. You just give in all the time. And there's got to be a balance. Because sometimes you are going to have to Bend the rules to show mercy, guys. Are you hearing me?
See, these are things where God is constantly concerned about our ability to get along and to communicate with each other and to have the ability to be honest and open to repentance. Are you with me? So the first thing is learn how to respond correctly. The second thing is physical touch. It's hard to be mad at somebody when they're touching you in an affectionate way. That's why ladies will be like, don't touch me. Because they know that the more you touch, the more affectionate she feels. And it begins to negate the emotions of wanting to be angry. And she has made the decision, I'm going to be angry with you right now. <laughs> Truth.com. And we have to learn, watch this, physical separation should be an absolute indicator for you. You know it is turned on God. Crickets, <laughs> crickets. And in those moments, can we work on trying a little more to Because you'll see that will change. It's revealed. It's revealed through prayer. And when you bring God into the middle of your communication, <laughs> tend to change the whole perspective of everything, doesn't it? I'm hoping that what we're able to do is to give you that place where we can actually begin to mend and heal the wounds in our relationships. Afford her that opportunity to express and to get into things that may be more emotional than you can process. But listen with the understanding that she is not asking you to fix it, she's asking you to listen. She wants you to understand, she wants you to connect. Because all you are just solved. Mr. Fix it. And if we begin to apply these principles in our lives and in our communication and our relationships, can you see how this would help us? Can you see how Yes, sir, it is a wrap. Shout out to my boy Diddy, man. Go check out his Instagram. I don't know which one you want to go pee. <laughs> Art the verse probably. That's a new uh, clip. Barber clip. Barbershop channel. Or barber channel. Barber channel. Barber Instagram. Check it out, man. I'm going to be posting up there soon. As soon as I get my camera and stuff like that set up. I'm going to be taking y'all to the journey. Even my YouTube bar be coming out soon. Y'all, y'all, y'all stay tuned, man. You dig what I'm saying? <laughs> get this money, man. So this is the clip. The clip. <laughs> The cut. The cut. Yeah. Alright, we're finna head out. Yeah, so huge shout out to Diddy for hooking it up, man. Clean fade. Clean fade. I've literally just been so busy, and like, I never put time aside to actually get a fade. But, today is looking super clean. And I'm super stoked on this. I need to shoot some photos since I actually have a fade now. My whole face just looks different since I get a fade, and like, I have my hair up. And don't worry, I just tied it all up with my hair. That's why it looks like that. But with all that being said, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hopefully you guys have an amazing day. Matter of fact, have a great day. Peace out and God bless.